ready for the day. I actually recorded like my skincare and stuff, but I didn't press record. So I was doing my skincare and talking to you guys without actually recording it. So I'm just filming this again, but I just did my skincare and obviously I can't do it again because I just did it. So I'm gonna show you guys the products that I used. Um, today's a very like natural day. I'm not wearing any makeup. Today is Monday. Um, we have it off today here. It's a long weekend for us. Um, so the plan for today is Jay and I are actually going out for breakfast with Jay's parents right now. We're going to be leaving in like, I want to say 10 minutes. After that, I'm going to be going and hanging out with Tylee. So I'm going to go drop her place and just spending the day with her there. But yeah, I'm going to show you guys the skincare products that I use. So you know I'm obsessed with Glow Recipes. So I'm using the toner. I absolutely love this stuff. It works really, really well with my skin. Like my skin looks so clear. It's never looked this clear. Um, which I love and then the niacinamide dew drops from glow recipe as well. I use that um, Running kind of low on the bottle. So I'm probably gonna pick up another one soon And then I have the glow recipe plum plum hyaluronic cream. I'm running really really low on this but I got a new bottle recently so I have a new one in here ready to go and yeah, that's basically the plan for today. So it's a very like chill, relaxing day. Jay and I are probably gonna pick up some food for dinner tonight. So I will show you guys that as well. I think we're thinking charcoal chicken, but I guess we'll see when the time comes and what we're doing. What I'm wearing, I'm wearing this Aritzia uh, sweater. It's in this like beige color, like brown beige color. And then I'm wearing my uh, little lemon aligned leggings. You guys know I live in these. I wear these all the time. And yeah, that's basically the fit for today. It's very gloomy outside today and like raining and kind of cold. So I wanted to wear a long sleeve to keep warm. Um, and then in terms of jewelry, I wear the same jewelry every day. So my return to Tiffany earrings, necklace, the rings I wear all the time, and my bracelets. And then yeah, that's basically how I'm looking. Very natural. I'm gonna be wearing my Louis Vuitton Speedy. Thank you guys a long day, so I will vlog when we get to the restaurant. Alrighty, you guys, and then we went out for breakfast with Jay's parents, and we obviously had to cheers. We got a bunch of food, and it was so delicious. It was such a good time, and then I also got some French toast. It was so good, and then I came home, and I checked the mail, and I got this uh, letter from Amanda Kate's baby shower. It was like a thank you card, and then I also got this package in the mail as well. It's by a brand called She Said Yes. They actually sent me a new jewelry item, and I'm going to show you guys what they sent me. So yeah, this is how it came packaged and the cool thing about them is that they are actually real gold earrings that they sent me so you guys will see that but tylee actually picked them out so i'm going to be gifting this to tylee so yeah they're going to look so good on her and this is what comes inside the box comes with this little ribbon and then it comes with a bag as well so like if you want to give this to someone it'd be perfect so yeah that's the little bag it comes with and i cannot wait to show you guys so this is how the box comes and this is how it looks inside she got these like diamond stud earrings they're so pretty and as mentioned they are real gold i do have a discount code which she said yes jewelry if you guys are interested everything will be down in the description but yeah i went to go visit tylee afterwards and i gave her the earrings and she was so happy and then on our way back we got some dinner so this is the dinner that we picked up we got charcoal chicken and it was so so good Alrighty guys, so it is the next day. I'm about to put some self tanner on my hands because they are very pale compared to my body. I do have a nail appointment later tonight that I'll be taking you guys along as to look tan. Um, I also did remove the um, zip that I previously had on my nails. As you guys can see, like I removed the top layer just so it's easier and quicker for when I go get my nails done, believe it or not, I actually hate getting my nails done. Like I hate the process of getting my nails done. Like I like the after of it, but I hate sitting at the nail salon for like hours getting my nails done. It's so annoying. So I always try to just like do 
like what I can to make the process go faster. So I, I'm gonna be getting a new set. I'm gonna be taking off these nails. I already just filed them down for him. That way he can just put the um, cotton balls and acetone on it and then they'll go faster because I don't got all night to be chilling at the nail salon. So that's the plan. I'm gonna put some self tanner on and I got a few questions asking me what self tanners I use. Also, any chance that I can get to show my new pajamas, I will. So I've been using the Bondi Sands um, self tanning foam mousse in the color dark. I love the Bondi Sands. I just recently started using it and I honestly love it. I feel like my tan looks so good and it lasts really, really long and it doesn't look like fake it doesn't look like orange it looks really really nice i have it on right now and i feel like it looks really really nice so i'm going to be using this for my hands and i'm going to get the glove and i'll show you guys how i do this is the glove that i use it is from bondi sands as well so basically what i do is i put like two pumps of it and then i just kind of like rub it in my hands and then i wash it off after like an hour um, I'm only going to be doing my hands today just because, as I said, I feel like my hands got really, really pale compared to my body, so I want it all to be even. So I'm going to be showering in like an hour, so I'm just going to shower this off after. But yeah, this is basically what I do, and I feel like it works the best for me. My hands always come out really natural, and yeah, so I do two pumps roughly, and I make sure to get all the... <laughs> the like nooks and crannies in my hands. And then also before that, I did apply lotion and I let that kind of sit in for like 20 minutes before I go and apply the self tanner. That way, like my hands are moisturized and the tanner doesn't absorb or like get patchy on like the dry portions of my hands. Cause if you have dry hands, then um, it, it's, it's more likely to like become patchy. So. Anyways, that's basically what I do, and I kind of just like make sure I get every corner, my knuckles, like around my cuticles, kind of um, like this, so you guys can see. And it does come out kind of like greenish right now, but after I washed it off, it becomes like the perfect tan color. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do, and then I'm going to go shower. And then, as I said, later tonight, I have a nail appointment, and I will take you guys along. So I'm going to be doing a new set. And I'm probably going to do French. I just want to go back to French. I miss French. I've done this for like a month, I want to say. And I want to go back to French because they last longer as well. Like you can't really tell when it grows out, um, which I like. So yeah, I'm going to go do that. And I'm going to let this kind of develop. And I will be back once everything is done. Alrighty, you guys, so I'm leaving to the nail salon soon, so I wanted to show you guys the before. So as mentioned earlier, I tried to drill off as much of the dip as possible because I'm going to be doing a fresh set, so I wanted the process to be faster. I'm also going to be doing a pedicure, so I'll take you guys along. So my toes currently are white, and they're kind of grown out, so that's why I wanted to... They can focus. That's why I wanted to do them both at the same time because it's just easier that way because i know i'm gonna have to get a pedicure eventually like within the next week so I just do it all in the same appointment so yeah this is the before i'm gonna be doing french and yeah, i'll take you guys along to the nail salon <laughs>
Alrighty guys, so I just got home and this is how my nails turned out. They look so good. I did the French a little bit different and I love them. And then also did white toes. I also did white toes. So this is how it all looks. They look so good, you guys. I'm obsessed. I just came back from seeing my parents as well. Mom got me the cutest bowls. Look how cute these are. They're so cute. I love them. They're white and they're cute for just like snacks or I don't know, just like anything. When guests come over, we can just like put out. Really, really cute. So I really like those. Alrighty, you guys. So it is the next day. I'm just going to show you guys a better look at my nails. Let's go to my beauty room. So these are my toes. They look so good. And I did white, of course. I've been loving white toes lately. I don't know why. I just love it. I am over the French toes for now. And then these are my hands. So I do have self-tanner on my body completely. Like I put self-tanner all over my body. So just ignore the color of my tanner. But this is how my nails turned out. They look so good. I love the French. I did the French a little different. So I did them um, not as deep as I normally do. And I really, really like how it turned out. So yeah, that's basically how they look. I'm going to end the vlog here. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.